So hey everyone welcome back to placements ready in this video we will be solving the problem minimum multiplications to reach end so let's read the problem statement so we are given start end and an array arr of n numbers at each step start is multiplied with any number in the array and then we do a modulus operation with 10 to the power 5 and is done to get the new start your task is to find the minimum steps in which end can be achieved starting from start if it is not possible to reach end then we have to return minus 1 for example here our array is 2 5 7 and start is 3 and end is 30 so how can we reach uh, from 3 to 30 basically we will first multiply with 3 by 2 so we will get 6 so when we do 6 modulus 10 to the power 5 we get 6 then if we multiply 6 with 5 we get a 30 and when we do a modulus we get a 30 so 30 is my end so we reach there in two steps so 2 is going to be my output i hope you have understood the problem what we need to do in this question let's discuss this question in more details so here our array is 2 3 and 5 and start point is 3 and end point is 30 okay. initially aisa lagega ki ye problem hamara array ka hai ya fir kuch array based kuch something use ho raha hoga theek hai but let me tell you this problem is from graphs and we have to give the minimum number of steps jab bhi tumhe is type ke questions mein minimum number of steps ka pucha jaye theek hai start ho end ho wahan pe soch lena bfs use hoga kyun because we know breadth first traversal kya karta hai ki hamara breadth wise manner mein travel karta hai re theek hai for example let's say this is the starting point theek hai tum is tarike se move kar rahe ho तो जब भी तुम इस लेवल पे होगे तुम्हारा नंबर ऑफ स्टेप जीरो होगा इस लेवल पे नंबर ऑफ स्टेप्स वन होगा फॉर एवरी नोट एट दिस लेवल ठीक है बट लेट्स अगर हम लोग डी कर रहे होते तो हो सकता है तुम एक स्टेप इधर जाते एक स्टेप फिर वापस आते फिर एक स्टेप इधर जाते ठीक है तो नंबर ऑफ स्टेप्स टू हो जाता बट अगर हम लोग बी करेंगे तो फॉर द सेम साइज वहाँ पर हमें नंबर ऑफ नोट्स मिनिमाइज होते हैं ठीक है तो बेसिकली वी हैव टू मिनिमाइज द नंबर ऑफ स्टेप्स सो वट वी आर गोन डू हेयर वी विल बी यूजिंग बी एफ so let's discuss how we can use bfs algorithm and how we can solve this problem so for bfs you know we need a queue okay so our queue will be a type of pair why pair hame sabse pehle to wahan pe node store karna hoga hai na aur node ka distance theek hai to do cheez store karna hai which will be of type end comma end theek hai to humne queue to declare kar liya theek hai अब देखो कैसे स्टार्ट करना है सबसे पहला स्टार्ट है हम लोग क्या करेंगे क्यू में स्टार्ट को पुश कर देंगे विथ था डिस्टेंस जीरो ऑब्वियसली स्टार्ट का तो डिस्टेंस जीरो ही होगा है ना देन व्हाट वी कैन डू वी कैन मल्टीप्लाई माय स्टार्ट ओके सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वी विल गेट दिस नोट आउट ऑफ द क्यू सो लेट से माई क्यू इज लाइक दिस टू कॉमा जीरो इज एट द फ्रंट वी कैन टेक दिस आउट we can multiply this two with again this two with again this three and five okay so hum log sara possible cheez dekhenge and it's given that we need to modulo 10 to the power 5 after each and every time so that is a indication that my array size cannot be greater than 10 to the power 5 okay so we can make a visited array of 10 to the power 5 size so assume it's a visited array of 10 to the power 5 size now when we take this out we will multiply this with 2 we get a 4 but now getting to a 4 will take a step 1 so we will push that in our queue and mark this 4 as visited since 4 was not visited so now 4 has been marked as visited and 2 is also marked as visited now we go to 3 we multiply 2 with 3 we get a 6 with a step 1 6 is also marked as visited now we again multiply this 2 with 5 so 2 into 5 is 10 with a step 1 so 10 is also visited now the next time you go to this queue you take this 4 comma 1 out of this queue we again do a multiplication 4 to ja 8 and this 8 will take me two steps and we will mark 8 as visited assuming ki ye hamara 10 to the power 5 size ka array hai and initially all the elements will be marked as unvisited we again take this 4 multiply this with 3 we get a 12 and we get number of steps as 2 your 12 ko visited mark kar do theek hai 
then we take this 4 we mark the with we multiply it with 5 we get a 20 with steps 2 so again mark this 20 as visited now next time you go to 6 you take this out of this queue so 6 comma 1 hamara bahar aa jayega you multiply 6 with 2 you get a 12 with a step 2 but since 12 was already visited we will not do anything now you mark you multiply this 6 with 3 also so you get a 18 with a step 2 mark 18 as visited now ma multiply this 6 with 5 you get a 30 Mul you get a 30 with a step 2 so mark this 30 as visited so in this way we are able to reach the end so if you continue this uh, queue ultimately at one point of time you will get this node out of this queue here you will come can compare that my node is equal to my end so you can return this answer simply okay whatever with the distance you can return it okay so here we have bfs algorithm se apna problem solve kar liya. that is going to be very simple and i hope if you have BFS pe problems in BFS, you will be able to solve these problems. There are many problems which are similar to this. Uh, like there is a problem like word ladder. Okay? And uh, prime count. In sare type ke problems are similar to this approach. So, you can do these problems. Ko bhi kar lena. And I hope you will have a problem in the Maximum, what we are going to do is that we will be having a queue okay max queue ka size kitna ho sakta hai 10 to the power 5 visited ka bhi size humne 10 to the power 5 liya hai theek hai and my time complexity is going to be 10 to the power 5 maximum because that number of nodes can get visited during the uh, course of time so this is the most optimal approach for this question so i hope you have understood the approach you have understood the time and space complexity Let's discuss the implementation. So here, first of all, there is a corner case. If start or end barabar hai, so we need to return zero. Now the second case is that we will be taking a visited vector, okay? And initially, we can assume that we are having this number of nodes, and initially all can be marked as unvisited. We will be taking a queue, which will be of type pair of intent, okay? And uh, we will be taking a queue which will be our type pair of intent as i told you it will be storing the node as well as the distance now we can push our start with the distance as zero and then we can mark that node as visited while my queue is not empty we will do our bfs initially my node is going to be q dot front will give me this pair okay and we can get the start easily using dot first and the distance is going to be q dot front dot second and we can pop that element out of the queue now we can multiply my x with each of the nodes so my new node is going to be array of i into x modulus 10 to the power of 5 as given in the problem if my new node is going to be end means that i have reached this new node by a distance of whatever be the previous distance plus 1 so we can return that simply and if my new node is not visited we can push that in our queue with a distance equal to previous distance plus one and we can mark that as visited so in the end when we are done with this and if we are not able to find the end node we can simply return a minus one so i hope you have understood the problem if you have any doubts write down in the comments and don't forget to watch the latest videos on graphs in i will provide the link to that in the description and do like this video if you have understood and subscribe to my channel for more such videos thanks for watching